Mama, I remember when I was a kid and used to treat those first days back to school like they was holidays. I guess we done got on your nerves all summer long. You just couldn't wait for us to go back to school. So that weekend, you'd take us school shopping and get us some blue jeans and some tennis shoes and you get us some shirts. And we'll get on back to the house and you'll cook us a dinner on that Sunday before that Monday. You you always cook us a pot roast stew and some, some collard greens and some mashed potatoes and some cornbread. And while you be in the kitchen cooking, we be in our room hanging out with that outfit that we going to wear on that first day back to school. So I decided I was going to make my own version of this pot roast stew. So I went and got me a chuck roast and I cleaned it off and I seasoned it down and I put it in my skillet and I browned it on both sides and I put that in my little roasting pan and I put me some butter in those drippings with a little, little what is this here sauce with a little broth and a little, little salt, a little onion powder, a little garlic powder. And I went on ahead and pulled that right over the top and I stuck that in the oven about, about 350 on the dash for a couple of hours. And I went on ahead and started on my stew and I, I got me some broth, some onion dip mix and some of that what is this here sauce with a little garlic. And I, I got me some onions and celery and carrots and I went and got my roast out the oven and I pulled that right over the top and I stirred it up and I seasoned that down and I made me a little slurry with a little cornstarch and water for a little gravy. And I pulled that over there and I let that set and get tender. And I started on my greens. I had some smoked turkey wings sitting in some broth. And I went and got my greens and I put it right over the top. And I let that sit and get tender. And I seasoned that down with a little onion powder, a little garlic powder, a little salt. And I went on ahead and boiled me some potatoes. I like little red potatoes. So I got some butter and some garlic and some rosemary and some sour cream and some onion powder. And I got a little garlic salt and I went on ahead and stirred that up in there. And I got me some oregano and I stirred that up in there. And I took those red potatoes and I mashed it up right there in that sauce. So I went on ahead and made it creamy. I got me some heavy whipping cream and I pulled that up in there and I stirred that up till it was good and creamy. And I went on ahead and checked on those greens and make sure they was good and tender. And I said, oh yeah, it's about time to eat now, but I need some cornbread. And I said, I'm going to do something different with this cornbread. I'm going to make me some, some waffle cornbread cornbread cake. So I pulled out my waffle line and I sprayed it down with a little oil and I took that cornbread mixture and I pulled that in there till it was good and done and I made me some honey butter to go with it because I was trying to make my plate look pretty like they be doing on the internet. So I took the cornbread cake and I put down the plate with a little honey butter, a little collard greens, some of that rosemary mashed potatoes and I took that pot roast stew and I pulled it right across the top and I started digging in and I said, man, I don't know what I'm thinking about it. I need a real plate. So I got me some old rosemary mashed potatoes and some of that pot roast stew and some of those collard greens and that, that cornbread cake with a little honey butter on the top. And I went on and put me some hot sauce on it as I was sitting back thinking about those first days going back to school. Mama, she ain't paying me no never mind. Mama, he ain't paying me no never mind. Mama, they ain't paying me no never mind.